So because I tend to chat way too much bollocks in my videos over seemingly simple topics, I'm introducing a new feature to this channel. This is One Minute Wednesdays. So this video is gonna be focused on squaring the end grain of timber with very limited resources. So without further ado, timer in the top left corner, Let's go, come in close. So obviously the end grain is very difficult to plane if you have it upright in a vise and you're trying to plane the end like that, you'll end up splitting the end off. You can try and sham for the end on it to prevent that, but getting it square flat and everything is an absolute nightmare. So normally we would use something called a shooting board, which looks like this. Raised platform, something for your plane to run along and a square fence on it. So what we're gonna do here is make a very, very simple one. I've got a flat bit of plywood on the bottom, two clamps on that back fence, keeping it all in place. Just gonna square this back fence up with the edge of the plywood here and I'm also gonna make sure the fence is overhanging this side by about a millimetre. Cramp this down, really wrench these round because that's gonna be what holds your fence in place. And now as it's overhanging here, we need to plane it down a bit. So as you can see on the back end here, the fence is breaking off and this is exactly why we're using a sacrificial fence for this. We don't want this happening to our timber. There we go, and it'll get to a point where the plane stops cutting. And now we can just put the wood on there and shoot it through as it would on a normal shooting board. There we go, all nice and square. That probably sounded absolutely disgusting on my microphone. And there you go, that is how you square end grain with two cramps, plain, square. Whew, that was more stressful than my GCSEs. But look, what we're left with is a perfectly square edge, no breakout in it whatsoever. And that's helped me out of a few situations where I've been exhibiting at shows with Axminster, forgot to bring a shooting board and I've needed to knock something together. This has done it for me and I've been able to do my demo as normal. So I hope you found that useful and enjoyed the new format. Let me know if you have any other suggestions and topics you'd like me to talk about, but not babble on about, of course. Yeah, see you in the next one.